What's up, everybody? Jay with Longhorn Investments here, joined by Joseph Taneo and Ryan Hampton from Ford Investment Group. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about wholesaling, how they can help you, uh, and how hopefully we can be a part of that process as well. But gentlemen, thanks, uh, thanks for taking the time. You're welcome. Yeah, yeah, glad to be here. Thanks, Jay. So let's uh, let's start with the basics. Uh, what is it that you guys do? Well, we uh, we invest on on our own uh, time, but during through the business, we basically find off market distressed properties and and market them to in buyers, and uh, that's pretty much it. That's the basics of it. Some of them we'll uh, kind of keep for our own selves, you know, our own rental portfolios. Yeah, everything that we get, we run an analysis on. If it doesn't fit our numbers, uh, what we specialize in is uh, connecting it to an in buyer. So, yeah. So people who are experienced, obviously, they know what wholesaling is. They, you know, they've they've probably been involved in some capacity. Uh, for people who are just getting started and they hear the term wholesaling, what's the the best way to kind of explain the mechanics of it and and how they can perhaps benefit from getting in touch with a wholesaler? So. Uh, most days what we do, uh, we're on the phones, we are uh, finding deals. So, you know, the, the best thing we can provide is being a source for deals. We're, uh, you know, a deal source. So, uh, you know, you can just come to us, we can get you on a list, a VIP list. We could, uh, you know, if the relationship grows, we can put you, uh, notify you first of what we get, you know, it just depends on the relationship, but we are going directly to sellers. Um, we're getting good prices. Uh, you know, it's the prices are going to be a lo lower than what you'd find on the market. So, yeah, and we're essentially deal finders and we, uh, we basically lock things up, get them under contract and we assign our interest in the property to an end buyer. So, yeah. Yeah. We could also be a, a, you know, uh, a source for, you know, creative finance, but they need to use you guys to, uh, you know, do some kind of a uh, bridge loan to, uh, before they refinance, you know, so it, there's all kind of, uh, you know, the opportunities there. Yeah, we go ahead. No, no, go ahead, Ryan. I was going to say we specialize in single family residents and throughout the Birmingham market. Also, we've been getting some land deals and multifamily deals as well. What's the? It seems like the Birmingham market's been uh, been awesome here lately. What what have you guys noticed about the market here recently? And and perhaps what are you expecting? Uh, maybe in the coming months, if if you expect any change at all. Uh, I just expect prices to continue to rise. Um, so that makes it even more uh, important for somebody that's been thinking about investing. That you know they don't know what steps to take. Uh, you can connect them with us because we have, you know, also that knowledge too, because we actually hold rental properties on the side too. So, I mean, inventory is low, demand's high. Uh, they want to make a, if they want to do a flip, they're going to make a profit in this market. So as long as they're buying in pretty decent areas. And then with, with each of you having significant experience just in the real estate world, you know, as investors and, and being a part of it from, from that lens, uh, how how does that benefit the people who come to you and, and want to uh, develop that relationship, knowing that you kind of know what they're trying to do? You've been in their shoes and, and still actively, uh, I guess, in a different world, you still are in their shoes. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, a lot of times people don't know who to turn to when they when they're thinking about investing. They're like, I mean, who, who do I talk to? What is it? What is even a wholesaler? You know, so I, I think just us having our own rentals on the side definitely helps because uh, we, we can put, break it down into steps for people. And Brian can add to that. Yeah, absolutely. Joseph, being an agent, uh, he's worked as an agent for several years. He knows the market in and out. So he brings a lot of value to the table. Um, so, yeah. And as investors, I grew up with a my dad's a landlord and I got into it as a, at a young age. So we've got the experience and, uh, and we've kind of perfected the art of finding the deal. So that's uh, one benefit we bring to the table. A lot of the investors, you're out there actually working on your deals when you get them, flipping them, managing flips. So you don't really have time to do the, the hunting yourself. So we can lock them up at a low price and assign them to the end buyer, make it an easy transition. Yeah, I want to add something, Jay, too. Uh, you know, we also know the different rules. So we like, we know what the 70% rule is. We're not going to send a deal out that's over that if, if, if the buyer doesn't want, you know, if, if they have rules, we, we know how to follow those. So. Perfect. And I'm curious, you know, Joseph, we've obviously over the last, gosh, eight months, maybe, maybe a little longer, maybe a little less, we've, we've worked together, not only on your own stuff, but 
uh, people with uh, whom you've worked. Uh, I'm just curious, and, and uh, you know, you can say whatever you want. I'm not, uh, you know, I'll send the Venmo afterwards. But uh, what, what is what is it that's allowed us to have a successful relationship, and and maybe something that's important for borrowers to know? Uh, you know, that's benefited the, uh, I guess, the, the the communication and just the execution of everything. Um, when it comes to lenders, sometimes it's hard to even get them to, to call you back. I know, Jay, you you text back on a drop of a hat. I mean, it could be Sunday morning at 6 a.m. You're going to reply back. And that's the confidence we need, especially when we're borrowing a lot of money. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, most people are kind of shocked at the, uh, the numbers we're throwing out. But uh, I mean, that, I think that's really increased my confidence in you guys. And I wouldn't you know, hesitate to recommend anybody to you. Uh, yeah. I wouldn't hesitate to uh, recommend anybody for investing financing other than you. So, All right. Well, I, we appreciate that. And we've loved working with you guys as well. You know, one of the things we love with wholesalers, it, it kind of allows us to highlight uh, one of the, the features of what we do and that's, you know, quick turnarounds, right. You know, yeah. when, when you get involved in a wholesale deal uh, you don't have four weeks to close three weeks, you know, when we can get things done quickly and, and you want to be able to get things done quickly. Could you just kind of expand on, what people should expect from a timing standpoint? Oh, yeah. I mean, I think, you know, you guys fund quicker than anybody that I've ever dealt with. I mean, usually if you go up to a hard money lender, they're going to tell you, hey, it's 21 days or, or or no deal, you know, or if you're putting money down, you have to put something down or no deal. No, you guys, you fund 100% of the deal if the numbers work uh, and you have quick turnarounds, you know, you usually can uh, close a deal on usually any timeline, as long as we get, you know, everything into you guys. So. And just in general, I mean, we've covered a few things here. We've kind of bullet pointed some stuff, but is there anything we haven't covered that uh, you think is important for people to know as far as what you all do and maybe how to uh, best utilize what you all do. And, and so people watching this can reach out and, and grow that relationship. Um, I think one thing I would like to add is like, you know, investing's not, as hard as it looks. Um, it's just know it, you got to know the right people. Um, and we welcome anybody with, que you know, with questions that anybody that, you know, that's been thinking about investing. I mean, there's plenty of business out there for everybody. Um, and I want, and it's important to know, you know, you don't have to have a lot of money to do this. I mean, you know, like you, you guys doing a hundred percent of it, you know, funding a hundred percent of it is, uh, is a game changer. So Ryan, you Absolutely. Know. Yeah, that's about it. We have an open line of communication with everybody out there. So if uh, there are any questions, any, any kind of partnership we might be able to form, and we joint venture with a lot of other investors. So, so yeah, that's a shout. And let me ask you guys this, and, and want to definitely give out your contact information, and, and we've had it kind of streaming at the bottom here, but uh, what I'm, one of the things that, that I get you know, from a, a phone call standpoint is someone they generally want to learn about what we do, but they don't really have much of a plan about what they want to do, uh, you know, what, what their niche is going to be. And that's fine. I mean, people have to start somewhere, but uh, you know, it is, it, it does expedite the process, maybe make it a little easier when someone calls and says, Hey, I'm looking for single family in this area. Uh, you know, my, my, my purchase price range is from X to Y, uh, you know, just so you know, kind of what I'm looking at. When someone calls you guys, if someone's going to reach out, what if it's possible, what is the information that they can share with you that will allow you all to, to best form that partnership? Uh, number one, uh, risk tolerance is definitely a big factor. Um, and it, the, we like to talk about how we want to build our business around our life instead of our life around our business. So basically what's the most important thing to you? You know, how do you, how much time do you want to spend on your investments? That's one big factor because Birmingham has a lot to offer. You know, the multifamily, we've got the single family residence, commercial. A lot of people are doing Airbnbs here, believe it or not. Uh, there's a lot of, you know, we Airbnb our house out before and when we went out to Arizona for three months and some people, it stayed booked because, you know, multiple reasons. Especially the, uh, we got one of the number one hospitals here in the Southeast. So that's, that's draws a lot of people here. Yeah, I would say 90% 90, 90 of our, uh, you know, buyers are people that they have a lot of money, but they don't have a lot of time. Yeah. So, you know, we, we're doing this, I don't know, probably eight hours a day. Uh, you know, we grind. So Monday through Friday. So Monday through Friday. All right. Best way for people to reach out to you guys. Uh, they, they can call us at uh, 205 uh, 
235-8908. We can uh, link uh, our Facebook page, our Instagram. uh, Forwardinvestmentgroup.com. Yeah, yeah, we're all over the socials. Don't look for TikTok. We're not on there yet. (laughs) We're not that that cool yet. (laughs) Well, I'm not either. That's partially because I can't dance. If we get a billion <laughs> views, then uh, I think uh, Ryan just volunteered himself to do a TikTok dance uh, yeah. uh, to date be able to... Forward Investment Group TikTok <laughs> channel. <laughs> you got it. The TikTok challenge for Forward Investment Group. Yeah, there you go. Well, fellas, thanks so much for sharing what you do. I'm looking forward to working with you in the future. Absolutely. Definitely. Thank you, Jay. Thank you.